we're back. I'm Carlotta Champagne, and we are doing another clothing haul today with vintage jazzercise outfits. I feel like I need to be working out all the time. I think my boobies would fall out of this if I tried to work out in it. You're gonna fall out of this. You're gonna fall out of this. This one, I don't know how anyone wore this to work out because I'm kind of busting out. So, anywho. I have a whole bunch of Jazzercise outfits. I'm really excited to show them off. There's some really cool ones, let me show you. Got like thongs, they're all thongs. Who worked out in thongs? This is like a, I don't know, definitely an 80s thing. Let's see, like this. I don't think I would ever work out in that today, but I'm willing to try it on and let you guys make a decision. But until then, uh, let's check out this one. So we have stirrup pants, which are super fun. Um, definitely a thing of like 70s, 80s. Although I think that they've had like their moments in the 60s, the 90s. They just keep coming back, but they never look any better. Anyway, I like the color. It's nice and shiny and this tiny shirt. I kind of wonder, are you supposed to wear this over one of the workout onesies? I don't know, check it out. I have to try to work out in these. <laughs> okay, on to our first outfit. And we are back. So I figured I'd put some tights on with this because they did a lot of weird tights and pantyhose and things. Because why not? Why not, right? So I kind of love this as a swimsuit or lingerie, but I don't think it would work out in it. But it's really hot. I love that it has like this peekaboo zipper. And check this out, it's a thong. And unlike the girls of the 80s and 90s, I think we appreciate a bit more booty these days. So maybe that's why it's harder to work out in these. I need, I need butt support. <laughs> so anyway, I feel like I need to be working out all the time and seeing if it's, I don't know, how do you work out in these? Anyway, I really like this outfit, but as lingerie. So tell me what you guys think. Let me know which ones are your favorites. On to the next. We are back. Okay, this is another one that I'm like, I love it. This is like a great swimsuit, great lingerie design, but I think my boobies would fall out of this if I tried to work out in it. So first off, like the straps are basically covering my nips. And then we're in another thong. So. <laughs> Who's working out like this? I feel like there's there's some sort of like, is this the jazzercise moves? Anyway, check it out. Let me know what you think. Man, I kind of wish that it didn't have the jazzercise thing on it because I would totally use this for just lingerie shoots. Now they have to be themed around working out, I guess. So <laughs> anyway, um, I hope you like what you're seeing so far. I've got so many good ones. So anyway, let's go to the next. And we are back. And this outfit, ooh, I don't know. I don't know, I like it. It's cool lingerie, but workout gear, maybe not so much. It's like awkwardly, it's got the frontline seam, which I always tell designers, it's a big no-no unless you want epic camel toe. So you figure you're jumping around in a workout class, you're gonna be like really showing the toe. And then of course, if you get too hot, you've got this like handy dandy zipper. So you can let some air flow in. <laughs> can you imagine like you're, you're gonna fall out of this. You're gonna fall out of this. And then back to the thong, of course. So I'm positive a man designed these. I don't think there's ever been a woman who was like, yes, I want my boobs and my butt to be falling out at the same time while I do jumping jacks. But you know what? Thank you. This is pretty fab. I'm going to wear it anyway. Just not working out. Okay, on to the next. And we are back. Okay, this is probably actually what these outfits are supposed to look like. It covers a bit more, still got a thong. I put the pants that I was originally wearing underneath and that makes a lot more sense to me because now you don't feel like all your bits are falling out. <laughs> 
So check it out. And I kind of like the idea of a thong over pants. It's like a little bit sexy, but you're still covered. Kind of not freaking out about what you're showing everyone at the gym. And maybe this one's the most conservative, but it's the one that makes the most sense to work out in. But of course, let me know which ones are your favorites. On to the next. And we're back. This is our final outfit. This might be my favorite. Let me know what you guys think. I paired this jazzercise top with an 80s bottom that I already had. Um, definitely still in the same vein, still for workouts, still a thong. And you know, jazzercise is such a fascinating thing. It has been around since 1969. They just used the most popular music of the times. And we've seen it everywhere. Like even the Golden Girls mention it. That's how big it was. And who wouldn't want to see Dorothy in one of these, right? You want to see Dorothy work out in a thong? Why not? The Golden Girls are the best. Anyway, check this one out. I'm pretty convinced that Jazzercise is basically just like a retro version of Zumba, so you'll just have to put me in the Jazzercise thing doing Zumba moves. <laughs> so it turns out that I have a lot more of these outfits, not just Jazzercise, but vintage 80s, 90s, and some 70s even. So I think I'm gonna do a part two, so stick around.